Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I decided to do a speed paint of a side profile version of my OC Carla. Carla has been featured in Misty Cove before, so you probably already know her. In this speed paint, I aimed to work on side profiles as well as a little bit more of light direction and shading. So let's get into it. Side profiles. Side profiles have always been quite difficult for me just because I find it difficult to have balance between the eyes and the rest of the face as well as where the nose should be. I always seem to put it too high up on the face, but thankfully with a couple of references, I'm pretty sure I was able to sort this out in this speed paint. However, it definitely took a lot of time to do that. As for the proportions in this, I wasn't super happy with them. I was pretty happy with the ones in the last video, but in, however, in this video in particular, I felt like her leg looked like it was kind of breaking because I didn't draw it out well enough when I was doing the sketching phase, and it just didn't turn out as well as I would have liked it to be. As for the head size compared to the rest of the body, I also felt like that was a bit wonky. And another thing with the proportions that bothered me was definitely the head. I felt like it was a little bit too big for the body. And now we're on to the coloring. So, for the coloring, I wanted it to be dark outside since I wanted a nighttime sort of photo. So hopefully that explains why a lot of these colors are darker and a little bit muddier. Uh, the muddier colors are definitely something I Originally in this speed paint, I was going to make the prime light source a bunch of fireflies that, as you can see, are being released from the lantern. However, the speed paint kind of shifted when I decided to add in the moon, and then I thought, well, what's brighter, the moon or fireflies? Probably the moon. So, I made the prime light source the moon. As for the moon in particular, I haven't really done any reflection sort of things up in the water, and I was pretty proud by the end of this that it turned out pretty decently, I'd say. I also had to do some color correcting because I felt like it was too blue and I wanted to make it a little more purpley just so it would kind of fit in better with uh, Carla's pink-based color palette. Overall, I thought that I did pretty decently on this, and I hope you can agree too. Thank you for watching this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and also make sure to click the bell for more content. And I'll see you guys soon. Goodbye!